Yo, what is going on everyone? Guiding Light here back with another video and in this one I'm going to be explaining to you guys how you can actually unlock the harm challenges here in the Avengers beta. Now once you guys have completed some of the harm challenges you will actually unlock the Hulk mining tools as well. I have completed everything, it took about 3 hours to do so if you were looking to get these mining tools it will take you about that much time, about 3 hours. So keep in mind guys the beta will be free in about 2 weeks and you'll have about 2 or 3 days in order to actually get all of this done. You don't have to do it all at once because the game will save, but either way guys, let's get right on into how you're going to unlock these harm challenges. So basically what you guys will need to do is just complete a few of the story missions. The game will immediately take you to all of these missions and direct you exactly what you need to do. There's nothing really too special or out of the way you guys need to do. Eventually you're going to get into the first story mission that you can play with online players. Now once you beat this mission, it'll take you back to the ship. And it will show you guys the harm challenges, the holographic augmented reality machine. From here, you will be able to start the harm challenges. And the very first mission, you're going to have to go a little bit out of your way in order to start this. So I'll take you guys through the ship and show you guys exactly where you need to go in order to unlock this. So as you can see, it says harm room unlocked. And in order to get to this part of the beta, you're going to have to go through a few of the story missions. It'll take about maybe an hour and a half. And then from here, what you want to do is go through this door. You're going to want to head down these hallways and I'll take you exactly to where the harm room is. Now the very first mission that you guys complete is going to be the tutorial. After that there's going to be three missions that you guys need to do. This is just a little side room that has a collectible in it so you don't really have to stop in here if you don't want to. But I ended up stopping in here and getting this comic book which you can use as a upgrade item. Now keep in mind as you guys play the game and complete the harm challenges you w might want to actually go about upgrading some of your armor. The challenges can be a little bit difficult once you get to the second or third one and you might want to actually level up a little bit or do a few story missions first in order to get these done on your first try otherwise it could take a little bit longer. Either way though guys what you want to do is head into this room here. You're going to see that there's a big plane you want to head into this room. This is where the hangar is. From here you want to go downstairs and this is where the harm room is actually located. So as soon as you unlock the harm challenges you can come down here start doing these missions and actually begin unlocking the mining tools. So what you want to do is actually go into this room here, right at the bottom of the stairs, walk down the hallway and use the laptop that you guys find. You're going to be in this little green room and it, you can see at the top left corner there it says that we are in the harm room and what you guys need to do really is just go to the back of the room. You're going to see a little laptop and from here it will take you into your very first challenge. Now the first challenge is just a small tutorial so just do what the game tells you to do. It's going to have you dodge over some enemies. It's going to show you how to fly, how to do a few little combos and stuff. And once you complete the tutorial, you will be able to start the rest of the harm challenges. So I'm going to leave the gameplay in here of me completing these small challenges just so you guys know what to do. The very first step of the tutorial is just going to have you uh, getting some energy, showing you guys how to run around, dodge enemies, stuff like that. And this is actually going to help you guys complete the harm challenges once you do start them because there's going to be a lot of enemies. These are 10 different waves of enemies that you guys actually have to defeat. So here in the first part, this is just the tutorial. Just look at the top left screen. There's going to be a little objective you have to complete. So in the first wave, you just have to defeat the enemies. So we're going to do that really quickly here. After that, it's going to have you guys counter enemies. So what you need to do is wait for the enemies to try to attack you. You're going to see a little red circle come up or a little uh, white circle come up. Sometimes it'll even be yellow. And what you need to do is just time it right and hit R2 as soon as that circle does pop up, as soon as the attack pops up. And as you can see, you'll be able to counter. And that's going to be the second step that you guys need to do. After that, it's going to tell you to get intrinsic energy in order to do this. What you guys need to do is just use your light attack, so you're going to be hitting square, damaging the enemies, and this is actually going to charge your bar at the top, which is going to allow you to do your special abilities a lot faster. So you need to do this about three or four times, and it'll bring you on to the next stage. The next part of this is going to have you to vault enemies, so as you can see, you're going to want to hold circle while running towards an enemy. You're going to jump over them, and that's going to make it easier to attack them. You're going to need to do this three times, so as you can see, it's pretty easy. You just keep running at them, jumping over them, and that's how you're going to complete that little section there. After that, it's going to teach you how to fly around the map, so just do what it asks you to do. It's going to have you hover, it's going to have you descend, it's going to have you dodge some attacks. So just do all of this, and that should be the last step of the tutorial. So after you guys do 
this little bit here, you're going to have to defeat four enemies. It shouldn't really take very long. The tutorial is really, really easy, but it will show you the basics of the harm room and show you guys how you're going to complete your three challenges after you complete the tutorial. So do keep in mind, like I said, you will have to play about an hour and a half of the storyline before you get to this part of the game. You cannot just download the beta, jump right in and go right into this room. You will have to do about an hour and a half of missions first, and eventually you will get to the part of the game where you unlock the harm challenges. There'll be a big message that pops up saying harm challenges unlocked like I showed you at the beginning of the video. So you're just gonna unlock the harm challenges by completing about an hour and a half of the story. You're then gonna wanna follow the route I showed you guys through the ship to get to the harm room. After this, you're gonna do the tutorial I just showed you. And then as you can see, you will get the message that says harm challenges. And this is when you can actually begin to do the three harm challenges that you need to do in order to unlock the pickaxe. So after you finish the tutorial, it is going to take you back to the ship and in order to start the harm missions again and actually get going on the pickaxes, what you need to do is just go through these little menus here. After you complete that tutorial, it's going to tell you that you've unlocked Iron Man and a few different Avengers that you can use. From there, what you want to do is go over to this navigation globe here. Now, this is the navigation globe that's going to take you to all of the different missions throughout the beta. But what you guys want to do is click on the Hell Carrier. There's a bunch of different locations you guys can go to, but don't really worry about those other locations if you don't want to do those missions just yet. What you want to do is click on the Hell Carrier, and this is going to allow you to start the other harm challenges. So just click on the Hell Carrier, it'll be right in the dead center. As you can see, there's some other missions that you guys can do if you want to level up a little bit to make the challenges a little easier. But in order to just do the harm challenges and be done and go back on Fortnite in order to get the pickaxes, what you need to do is just go to the Hell Carrier. Once you click on that, you're going to see some more missions pop up. And what you need to do is just click on the missions that pop up. You're going to see that the harm challenges are here. So these are the missions you guys want to do. There's harm challenge one. Once you complete harm challenge one, it will unlock stage two. Then when you, once you unlock stage two, it will also unlock stage three. So just click on that mission. It'll bring you to this little window here where you can select which Avenger you want to use. And what you want to do is just select the hero you want. You can even invite some friends to do this with you if you want to do that. But you don't have to do that. It's going to give you some AI if, if you don't want to wait for your friends or anything, it'll give you some AI. So just click launch mission and this will take you straight into the harm challenges. As you can see in the top left corner, it says that I'm going into harm challenge one. So here's all of the details you guys need to use. Now you can select different Avengers. You don't have to use the same character every single time, but it'll bring you straight into this room. Once you're back in the harm room, it's going to have you go through 10 different waves of enemies. So this is where it does get a little bit difficult. The first challenge isn't really all that hard but once you get to stage two and three it will be a little bit harder so what you guys need to do is survive all 10 waves keep in mind you will go down a few times if you go down more than two or three times it will make you restart all over again so you want to watch your health make sure that you're picking up health packs and stuff and as you can see in the top left corner it says waves completed zero out of ten so what you need to do is just complete all ten waves and this will complete the mission. So we're gonna fast forward a little bit. We're gonna go straight to wave 10. These missions do take about 10 to 15 minutes to complete and you have to do three of them. So this will take about you know 45 minutes to an hour to do, well, even after you've gotten to this point in the game, which is why I say it does take about two or three hours to fully unlock these pickaxes. So just go through all 10 waves and after you're done, it'll bring you back into the ship. And this time around, it should show you that the harm challenge two is available. So just go, and head and knock that challenge out as well after completing challenge two it'll unlock challenge three and once you complete challenge three you will be completely done so i'm just going to fast forward through the second and third missions i'll show you guys that i did get it completed now after you complete the third harm challenge a big giant message will actually pop up telling you that you have completed the beta and that you have unlocked the Hulk mining tools and that all you'll need to do from this point is sign into Fortnite. So as you guys can see, after I completed all three of the harm challenges, it says special reward from Fortnite. You do need to make sure your accounts are linked up. So long as the accounts are linked up, you should be good to go. Log back into Fortnite and you should have the Hulk mining tools unlocked as well. So that's pretty much it for me in this video, guys. It's how you're going to unlock the harm challenges in the Avengers beta. And that's also how you're going to complete them in order to unlock the Hulk mining tools. So hope this helped you guys out. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.